Okay, first we're going to start by deleting everything. Then next we're going to add a plane. Go into edit mode and take these two vertices to make the plane into a rectangular shape. And next we're going to select all and extrude upward. Then next we're going to select the top face and the bottom face. We're going to next press I to scale in and then we're going to right click to bridge the two faces together. And then we have made our frame. Next we're going to select these four vertices in the middle. And then press F to fill it in. And then we're going to press P to separate this plane. Then we're just going to bring it down a bit, like that. Then next, we're going to select the plane and press Shift D. Then we're going to tab into edit mode, take face select and press I again. Now we're going to select this plane in the middle and delete it. And we're going to now select the rest and extrude upwards. Then next, we're going to go over to the shader editor and we're going to select our outer frame and make a new material. We're going to make this material a shade of black, like so. Then we're going to select the inner frame and we're just going to leave that as the normal default material. Then we're going to move into the inner photo and we're going to select a new material Press Shift A, add a image texture, and then we're going to link this image texture to the principle, and then we're going to go and open up our image, which you can find in the link below. Then now, to fix the image, we're going to tab into edit mode, select the plane, then press U to unwrap it. And then now we're going to go over to the UV editor, we're going to select the two vertices and make sure that they fit the image. Then we're going to press A to select everything, right click and press mirror on the X. And now our photo is facing the right way. And now we've finished and made our framed photo. 